Like and subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to get new video updates. Middle East rapprochement. Who will lose? Change is on the horizon in the Middle East. The region's political landscape shifts as rapprochement merge. In a series that has surprised observers, China has brokered a détente between Iran and Saudi Arabia, whose hostility has long been a cornerstone of disputes in the Middle East. In a matter of days under Beijing's watch, the reconciliation between these regional centers of power changed the main contours of the political landscape. The Saudi-Iranian reconciliation is not the only example of regional realignment efforts are also being made too to rehabilitate Assad's regime back into the regional fold. As new alliances emerge, winners and losers emerge. These developments have far-reaching implications for actors in the region, and understanding their roots and consequences is crucial for any observer. The standard mediated by China's Saudi-Iranianization is gaining momentum and progressing as the reopening of embassies and increased diplomatic engagement between the two nations appear likely. Both countries will benefit from this thaw in relations. Iran is breaking out of isolation, while Saudi Arabia could potentially break out of the costly and protracted conflict in Yemen, where it is basing off against Iran-backed Houthi forces. It was almost two years before Saudi Arabia's Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman expressed his desire for good relations with Iran, in an interview with Al Arabiya TV. Saudi and Iranian officials in Iraq had reportedly held dialogues to mend their fractured relationship, but progress stalled in the absence of an impressive mediator. In 2016, Saudi Arabia severed its ties with Iran, after a heated row between the two nations over Riyadh's execution of a Shia Muslim cleric, culminated in the storming of his embassy in Tehran. China's rationale for playing peacemaker in the Middle East has two reasons. To outmaneuver the United States and to ensure regional stability, which would facilitate the implementation of its belt and, 